girls welcome to fun friday and as you can see i'm not in my kitchen today i'm at the library because this week we started curbside service and that means you can call us or email the library and you can request up to 10 items books movies as long as we have them on our shelves we'll bring them out to your car or walk them out to be walk them out to you if you're walking to the library so we're super excited um, to start getting our library materials back in your hands. But for Fun Friday today, I decided to make bubbles because it's a beautiful sunny day and it would be a lot of fun to get outside and blow some bubbles. Maybe you don't have any at home, so this is a super easy recipe to make your own bubbles. All you need is warm water, some dish detergent. I am using Dawn. Um, they say that's one of the better ones to use, but you can use any dish detergent and sugar. So we're gonna get started. I'm gonna use a quarter cup of sugar and pour it in the bowl. And then I already measured out um, two cups of water. So we're gonna mix the sugar in the water. And if you have a whisk at home, you can whisk it together. I do not have a whisk, so I'm just going to mix it with a fork. And now I'm going to add my dish detergent. I do have some that I already made earlier to test it out and it worked fantastic. And now we're just going to add a quarter cup of dish soap. And let me fill this up. So do you know the secret to making bubbles, why this works? It's called surface tension. That's the science behind all this. So when you add soap to water, it changes the surface tension of the water and it allows you to blow beautiful bubbles. So now we're going to mix this up and it looks really pretty now, nice and blue. And I actually made my own wand because I didn't have any bubbles here at the library. So I just took a wooden dowel. You could use anything, a stick, a pencil, took a pipe cleaner, and I just put some beads on the pipe cleaner to uh, jazz it up a little and make it pretty. But you can just use a pipe cleaner if you like. You don't have to add the beads. And now we're gonna dip it in and we're gonna blow some bubbles. There we go. So this makes obviously two cups. So you can have a fun afternoon blowing bubbles. Any extra bubble mixture, you can put in a sealed container, a mason jar, um, so that you can have bubble fun for the rest of the summer. So thanks for joining us today, boys and girls. Have a wonderful day blowing bubbles and uh, call us or email us with your order. Look at that. Enjoy your day. Bye everybody.